Agzedo and I'd like you to have a go at this during the relief lesson today. So the first thing you'll do is you'll go to the uh, site called Tagzito and then you'll find the program tagzito.com and you'll open it and uh, when you get to it something like this you'll go to create now what Tagzito does is it um, is it links pictures and words and you can add which picture you want and you can add which words you want you can create some quite um, relevant logos some quite good designs and this is how you do that so the first thing I'm going to do is to well, you can see here there's a, a sample there we can just firstly have a look at um, uh, some other samples so if you go to um, shape you can have a look at these other shapes here that are these are the default shapes so let's say uh, we're doing something for Christmas so it might go um, might go Santa Claus I suppose okay now what will happen is that that particular image of Santa Claus will then be um, superimposed and you can sort of see that all the words that have made it, this up uh, fit into there if you go to shape one more time and then you choose the option called invert then it will put words in the background and then leave the image blank so hopefully we'll be able to see what happens there oh, I might have to go to uh, respin respin just um, reconfigures what it may look like still doesn't work there, try that again invert that one Sorry, that one there. Okay, that should do it. Okay, now it hasn't got the same amount of detail as the other one there, but you can sort of get the idea. Now let's um, consider putting your own words in. So the first thing you'll do is you'll go up to where it says load, and you can actually enter in a website and you can put the entire body of text of the Bible or something and you could you could add that and it'll have little tiny words all the way over or you can enter some text yourself now if this is something about you then uh, you can uh, add some keywords about you um, so I'm gonna do this one for St Monica's so I'll just take some keywords from our prayer so we've got persistence Determination Patience Love Kindness Persistence, Determination, Patience, Love, Kindness Spirit Okay, and we'll put down Respect so these are all things about St Monica's, some keywords there, so I'll just put down submit and then hopefully that'll rejig things. Okay, so there you can see there you can see that it's got uh, those words which have then been placed in there. So let's go back to shape and choose uh, there's, there's no dolphin unfortunately, I might choose the heart. So the house with heart. Okay, there we go. Now, if you wanted to make a silk screen and turn this into a T-shirt, then you might want to go to um, themes and instead of having all the colours, just simply have black on white, so that that can now be turned into a into a T-shirt um, pattern. Uh, but let's say that I'm unhappy with this heart design and I'd like to go and put in a, um, another design which is more relevant. So it could be um, a dolphin. But um, I've created a, uh, a new logo for St. Monica's and uh, I'll try and load that logo up. So being a shape, I'll have to go to the shape menu and then go down to add image. And then I'll need to um, browse where that image will be 
Now it needs to be um, a JPEG image and ideally it needs to be a black and white image as well. So open, that gives me an idea of what it may look like. You can see with this particular setup the text will be on the inside of the logo. So um, I'll just see what happens with this and we'll choose accept. Now hopefully you'll see what happens here. It'll try and superimpose those words. There we go. Leaving the logo in the background. Alright, so here's your task. I'd like you to find a JPEG image firstly and then save it as a JPEG. Uh, black and white would be good. Um, of a shape that is relevant to you or to a message that you'd like to send. Next thing I'd like you to do is to uh, create a new tag Zito and to um, load a whole heap of words which are related to what you would like to communicate. You can write down a whole heap and then I'd like you to have a go at creating uh, this particular image. Uh, so during today's lesson I'd like you to um, play with five different options and um, you'll be able to view those options by going down to the history and you'll be able to see all the um, the different variations that you've had and to uh, to show me that you've done some work today just like you to do a screen capture of the history and the way you do that is you go uh, command shift 4 and then you I'll do the whole thing so you highlight that particular page which does a screen capture of those images and then um, you can dump that into um, assessments on connect okay and I'll I'll create a new little um, uh, little assessment there for you to add that to using e submit all right so have a go with that and uh, thanks for your time